Hello, this is Tally Andrews and welcome to a very special edition of the Travel Daily Travel Channel. As part of our exciting Miss Travel Daily competition, we've had our contestants come into the studio here in Bangkok to make a guest appearance at our travel news desk. Let's take a look at how they went. Hong Kong-based Regal Hotel Group has announced the signing of the first hotel in its new luxury brand, Regal Royals, set to open in China, Jinsu Province in 2013. Regal Royal will be marketed as five-star premium brand offering high-end services. The first Regal Royal Hotel will be situated in Kunchon with approximately 300 rooms and suites. Food and beverage option including an all-day dining restaurant, a Chinese restaurant, a lobby lounge, and a patisserie and banqueting facilities. The hotel will boast 24-hour club lodges, state-of-the-art meeting facility, an indoor swimming pool, health center, indoor golf room and spa. The number of Australians taking a cruise holiday reached an all-time high in 2010, according to the figures released yesterday. The International Cruise Council of Australasia re uh, revealed that cruise passenger numbers surged 27% last year. Since 2002, the number of Australian taking cruise and holiday has risen 306% with an average annual growth rate of 19%. The annual growth in Australian cruise passenger number in 2010 was the one the highest of any countries, with only New Zealand registering a larger increase of 36%. All tourists in Beijing are planning to ramp up the protection of the old city over the next five years in a bid to achieve UNESCO World Heritage status. The development will focus on the historic areas connecting the former city gates running between the north and south of the Chinese capital. Meanwhile, Prince Charles' visit to Morocco last week is said to have shown the increased stability of the country once rocked by political demonstrations. In a media statement, Alistair Laxmore, Managing Director of Tour Operator Free Winter, said the royal visit has shown a more optimistic and positive image for the destination. He added that the country was safe to visit and there was little chance of growing unrest. Fur Chai has announced it will be exclusively sale or inclusive holiday from summer 2012. The move is in response to the growing or exclusive market, with account for 65% of first choice sales. The packaging will be available to book from May this year. Air France Lilo's direct flight to Tokyo Narita Airport on Friday through the Dewey starting earthquake that hit Japan last month, the airline's Japan flights have made a stopover in South and temporary base for flight crews. The Paris-based carrier will now operate in two days, flights to Narita and Dari service to Osaka without the carrier stop. And New Zealand has launched in the new Sky Coast sits on its London flight. The economy life flashes were soon out on the airline in a group B7737 flight from London to Auckland via Los Angeles on Saturday. The aircraft also features the new species in premium economy, which can be turned towards or away from filler traveler. American airline fare will now be available through Expedia again after company patch up sale depot. The online travel agent will have access to American inventory and fair initial through GDS technology. The companies have previously fallen out when American tried to drive booking through its own direct channel. And that's it. Stay tuned for more challenges and check out our contestants on Facebook at Miss Travel Daily.